Another developing story tonight. A woman from South Dakota was reported missing in early March. On Saturday, her body was found dismembered in a river in Menominee Township, Michigan. It's been a developing story, and now a man she reportedly dated at one time is in jail, charged with second-degree murder. NBC 26's Juliana Falk rep reports from Menominee County, Michigan. Two boys were walking their dog, and uh, they looked over the side of a bridge and saw a body in the Little River. The body, identified as 46-year-old Tamara Laframboise, a woman reported missing from Yankton, South Dakota. Tattoos found on the body helped us identify her. The Menominee County Sheriff's Department says when the boys found the body in this river, the head, hands, and feet were missing. They say the investigation is ongoing and they continue searching for those missing parts. Stephen Robert Falkenberg, originally from Menominee, is the man accused of killing Lafram Boyce. Court documents reveal the last known sighting of her was March 1st. He is known to have made a trip here recently, yes and that Falkenberg's brothers confirmed he was visiting them in Michigan beginning March 1st. His brother's home, 1.4 miles away from this river, her body was found in. Court documents reveal Falkenberg told his daughter he got in an argument with Lafram Boys. He says she swung a bat, then he pushed her. She fell and hit her head. He told his daughter Lafram Boys was dead and he dismembered her so she wouldn't be identified. Authorities in Menominee say she leaves behind her mother and kids. She was the mother of two young adult children. If you're a praying person, I would urge you to consider keeping their family in mind during the next difficult days, weeks, and months to come. Juliana Falk, NBC 26. And authorities say before we learn more, they are waiting for autopsy results. As for Falkenberg, the suspect, he's expected to be in court tomorrow morning. He's currently being held on $1 million cash bond.